the sweat co-op a co-op where me and four other sweats sweat on a completely new profile to see how fast we can progress with the no contraband one quick announcement i want to make is that i'm actually going to start streaming on twitch and some of this video was actually streamed on twitch so if you want to watch those streams follow my twitch or join my discord where i'll be pinging whenever i stream and if you enjoy these videos please consider subscribing because we're going to be doing something cool at 80k which i'm still in the process of choosing so this is being recorded after the actual video was done recording but i just wanted to say before uh, i get into it the reason i like look really dead when i'm doing this flip is because i was like recording it really early in the morning and that's the only reason and uh after we get to the stream portion it, it should be fine so uh yeah and uh let's just get right into it okay so you should be able to see that i have like five mil in my purse right now and uh i'm just gonna buy order 380 of these silverfish and then i think that's what they're called and then use them to craft magma rods and sell them and see if I make a profit on them. Okay, so I sold some of the rods, not all of them, but now I have about 2.8 mil to collect in auctions and something else sold. But I still have more rods to make and I am at the cap right now for auctions. So I'm just going to claim it and I just want to show you me actually claiming all these rods that I sold so I can go and put some others up. And then once I'm done that, uh, I'll be back. So let me just go claim this. 3.1 mil, that's pretty crazy. And we still have a bunch of rods to make and we still have some on the AH. So I'll be back when everything is sold. Okay, so now a decent amount of time has passed and I am pretty much done selling all of my auctions. And if we go and we take a look at the auction house, we can see that we made basically five mil off of these final auctions and since we spent five mil that means everything in my purse is basically profit so we a were able to get 8.3 mil out of five mil which is like 3.3 mil profit which is pretty good it took a decent amount of time to sell but i think if i just combine my rods instead of selling them all separately i could probably sell it a lot faster and I could actually make a lot of money. So I think I might do this a few more times and I'll be back once I make a ton of money with it. Okay, so this time I put like 30 million coins all into uh, those fish and made a bunch of magma rods and I've sorted them all into chests. So these are all the useless ones. Uh, these are actually very useful. Uh, these are semi-useful and I have a little bit more over here. These are also semi-useful and I have a little bit more over here. And then these are like basically useless but not as useless as those. And now I'm just going to go and combine them and then put them on the AH. Okay, so it took a little bit of time to sell but it is now sold. And if we go to the auction house and we just click here, uh, we made 62 mil plus whatever is in my purse. So let's just claim that and we made like, yep, 65 mil and we started with a little bit over 30 mil. So we basically doubled our money with this flip, I guess you could say, but it's a little bit of effort and it takes a little bit of time. But if you do it, you can make a lot of money from it. I think if I had more money and I was able to get more trophy hunter rods and stuff and I made like a max max one, I could probably make even more and it would probably not take as long. But obviously, I don't have that type of money yet. But once I do, I'll probably go and try doing that. But other than that, um, I think I'm going to go and start doing some uh, slayers. But basically, what I want to do with this money is start getting into some enderman slayer. Because enderman slayer is like kind of like really useful to do. That's how I get juju and all that stuff. And we can just buy a carry for some of the things. So yeah, I just want to start getting into Enderman Slayer, basically. I might need a little bit of guidance because I'm not the best. But otherwise, I think there shouldn't be much of a problem. Let me just do a test and see if I can actually do any of it. I have to kill the tier 4 Sven. Okay, well, I think I can do that. Three. I don't know why I thought it would be hard. Okay. Yeah, so now we should be able to do Void Gloom. Let's let's go and do, do that. Let's head down here. Okay, the... Tier 1 is literally so free. Like, I don't know why the difference in Tier 1 and Tier 2 is so big. But, like, it is for some reason. 
I should be able to easily do a tier one though. I, I would be pretty sad because I could literally do a tier one on stranded and on stranded, you can't even get the Slayer swords. Like you can't even get like Vorpal and stuff on stranded because you can't get like refined mithril or something. So you just can't craft it. It's crazy. We'll see. Someone was, is eventually going to be able to get like a judgment core on stranded. And it's not going to be, it's not going to take too long. Eventually it's going to happen. Yeah, okay, that was literally so free. I don't know if I can actually get a tier 2. Um, we, we might need to get a carry for a tier 2, to be honest. But, let's see. I can also just, like, get a better set and try it out. Who knows? I just I, I just want to see how, how well we can do. Oh, it spawned. Oh, n never mind. I have no chance of surviving that. Yeah, I have no chance. Okay, let me do another tier 2. But, this time I'll just get someone to carry me. Okay, I think he's got it. I just need to make sure I don't get killed. Yep, thank you. Um, I don't know how many I need. How many kills do I need? Okay, so let's look. We need, once we get level three, we get a Juju, which is quite nice. That's like two tier threes. So we might do that. No, but basically I think after I get a Juju, hopefully by the end of the stream, I'll be able to get myself a Juju. And by the time I get a Juju, I can use that to like destroy in dungeons early because I don't really like doing dungeons when you're like really, really bad. That's going to be kind of nice. So let's just go to the, um, not age. Let's go to here and let's start another one. Oh, it's Kata 15. Even Kata 15 isn't that bad. Um, I can just use some stupid setups until, until I get that. I still have the Flower of Truth, which is literally like a godsend early dungeons because it has no requirement. For absolutely zero reason i should be able to get cat of 15 quite quickly and once i'm done that it'll just make everything quite easy thank you thank you we got it hello okay i have i have unlocked it i have unlocked vo void gloom tier three let's go okay uh, i'm gonna pay this dude and then i'll ask him later maybe if i want to do more okay ty oh wait let me just I. Yeah, so now that we have that, I think I'm gonna go back to the hub and I can actually make myself a juju. So I can either craft one or I can buy one. I think if I buy like a good, like a giga jacked one, it's better than crafting. So because they're reselling, they put it for like a little bit lower because a lot of people re like sell jujus. So I think it's a better deal. Maybe not clean, but the other ones, I think so. Uh, I think Soul Eater is, is Soul Eater still like the, the main enchant for juju. Can I even use Soul Eater 5? I don't think I can use Soul Eater 5. Wait, wait, what? what is the enchantment level? I haven't, I've been, I've been sleeping on my enchanting, bro. I've been sleeping so hard on my enchanting, I can't see it. It's like 35, bruh. Okay, I need to start, like, actually enchanting for once. I think I'll get a Juju with Soul Eater 5 anyways, because, like, I'm gonna need it eventually. Like, it's not like I'm gonna use another one before it. Bro, that was actually, like, a good deal. Yeah, I think I'll just take that. Yo, wait, this is actually a good deal, because this is recommed, and I can use it. Goaded. Yeah, actually, that's so good. Yeah, so now we have a Juju. Obviously, you have to go for the damage test. You can't really compare it to anything, but like 37k, that's pretty good. One thing I wanted to try is if the Terra Boot glitch still works. Let's see, let's see how about the Terra Boots. So, I just want to look at boots right mana pool boots mana pool fierce that's actually quite good wait that's actually really good i'll just buy that right now i don't know if mana pool matters too much but i like having mana pool i want to know so basically the glitch is that if you read the ability right uh i think most people know what it is anyway but like basically it gives you an extra arrow like at 10 stacks your bow fires two extra arrows right and that's just by like hitting a bunch of like hitting a mob a lot so like if i use terror boots it should, I don't think the entire ability should work, but I think it's bugged where it does. If this still works, that's huge. Like, that's actually good, so good. Okay, well, I need to hit, like, one mob, if I remember correctly. You have to hit, like, one mob. Let's let's go to the Crimson Owl. Okay, let's go, go over here. If I'm hitting, let's say this. Will it start doing, shooting more arrows? Or did they fix it? Seems like they might have fixed it. Oh no, it's working, it's working, it's working, it's working. Oh, that's crazy. That's actually nuts. Bro, that's so good. I'm pretty sure it's a glitch. I don't know if it's intentional, 
I guess maybe at this point it might be intentional. But that's so good. That's literally basically... It, that's basically like Terminator level for the price of a Juju. That makes doing the Crimson Owl stuff a lot easier. And it makes gonna gonna be making dungeons a lot easier once I hit cat of 15. Yeah, th this is this is yeah, this is really good. Yeah. Okay, I didn't okay, okay. I haven't streamed for that long, but like there's not really much I was gonna do anyway on this stream. Um and I already have like some stuff I want to talk about in the video. I already upload like I've already recorded a little bit of flipping and stuff. So yeah, I think this is probably gonna be where I end it. And then Tomorrow, tomorrow I want to I want to start doing like a lot more stuff. Uh, I don't know yet. I'll find out. So uh, yeah, see you guys later. Bye.